contestants being television. Ours it is. Hello, and you're welcome to yet another amazing episode of the Ladies Talk Show. We're seeing the months of love. I'll be going from bed days to bed days. My name is Chikasi Ogbo, your host on the Ladies Talk Show. And of course, you can always catch past episodes on YouTube at Western Spring Television. Now, you of course know that I never do this on my own. I always got the beautiful, amazing soldiers, as I like to be called, on the show with me today. How are you guys doing? Very well, thank well, you. Very well. Well. Where's the ginger? What's happening? Is no. it happening? The ginger. See, Cassie. Oh. Yeah. Mm. Alarm, no reach your side. It's blue. Which alarm? Ah. I don't wake up Kasi, before alarm. You know, wait, wait. You know that you can't wake before alarm. You know that you can't wake up before alarm. You know that you can't wake up before alarm. Because the alarm when they blow. For this, I'm pushing. You wish for us to just do like this. Mm. To be honest. I feel you. Mm. I feel your vibe. I feel your vibe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Though I don't think it's reaching Nenge side though. I mean, yesterday was her birthday. Speaking about <laughs> birthdays. And it was a what? A shutdown? Or a <laughs> Which lockdown? <shutdown? laughs> Thank you so much, lady. Thank man. you. You know, even before this bed, I was just thinking about my life. I was hmm. like, hmm. I'm, I'm getting older. Okay. <laughs> I had the old moment of you realization. <laughs> I feel you. <laughs> to be honest with you, I just sat down and I'm like, ah, oh, I'm getting older. To be honest, like yeah. it was just yesterday, you know, the whole. I was even thinking about uh, my parents. How I used to like, I, they would not allow me to do some, some stuff, and mm. and now I'm on we my have, own, yeah, married, married, and I'm like, geez, this life is really, really fast. can be really fast sometimes. Yeah. Mm. And of course, but I, I was first excited yesterday about my birthday. You know, it's always, you know, it's it, it, it there's that joy that you're turning plus one, yeah. and, and you're yeah. like, exactly, you're alive. Yeah. You're getting to experience more things. You're mm -hmm. getting to be much more organized. Mm -hmm. I mean, some of your past experience has, you know, shaped your future you. already. Shaped yeah. you. And all of that, so I was super excited to uh, yesterday, rather, and of course it was it was, you know, yeah. It was love. Yeah. Happy birthday! It's, it's it's the, the, the month of love inside yeah. the month of love. Yeah. There is love. Yeah. love. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm really glad that your birthday was full of reflectiveness yeah. Yeah. for you. And I that, had to um, reflect because you know mm -hmm. some people's birthdays is all about rise and. All of that stuff. Yeah. But I'm glad it was a moment. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. We're happy you know, you Topper was saying she had a speech planned for you. So I'm looking forward to the speech, speech you were going to say today. Thank you, my love. <laughs> I love the shape of your hair <laughs> and your eyes. Thank you. So beautiful. <laughs> and I love that smile always. Oh, I like so you that smile always. And I like your gut to How are yeah. you doing? I'm doing you're great. You're looking really pretty today. Yeah. Is that something, you know, you're not telling us? This I mean, you're head. always beautiful, See, but today fish, you're looking really, really good. That's it. Yeah. And talk about this hair. Ah. You want to seize it? <laughs> ah, I want to seize it too. Hmm. Because you the hair is looking, she, she's looking good. True. Yeah. You know, someone was telling me that, why am I glowing? I was like, is it because, okay, um, maybe my wedding is a few yes. months or something. Yes. But anyhow, it's... Pre-wedding glow. Maybe, maybe, <laughs> but we don't look like what we passed through. So yeah. could be, uh, exactly. So exactly. you know, when you think about how things have really gone up in our country, like especially foodstuffs, you just want to make yourself happy. Mm. It's because not easy. Right now, my put some hands for love now. When they drink Gary, Gary is not coming again. Let ah, me come on my food. <laughs> Let me tell you now, Gary is not coming on my food. If you are drinking Gary. Will carry Dorime for you. <laughs> you know, it is at because this point, it's so expensive right yeah, now. Yeah, it is at this point where they say you are 100% in charge of, of your, your happiness. Yeah. It is Truly at this speaking. point you will definitely know Truly that you speaking. are in charge Truly. of it. I'm because telling you because things everything are is so everywhere. high, both the transport, everything. Mm. Like water to drink. Drink mm. water. Do you, know, do you know before a lame man can actually get pure water? 10 naira, 15 naira, and actually be okay. But now, pure water is like 25 naira or 30 naira. 30 naira in some places for Crazy. one. So I sometimes I sit back and imagine those who beg, how, how do they how oh. do they cope right now? Because you know, before you can dash somebody, Gary told yeah. you. No, <laughs> I'm telling you, but now <laughs> you have to think you twice. You have to think twice because Gary is that expensive right now. A, a, like let's say, for instance, here in Oshibo, a Congo of Gary is around 1-3. Just a Congo, which we're buying for like two fifty before, three hundred. Yeah. Oh. I'm telling you, beans is like one five. You can't really right nowadays you can't actually give someone something like 
you get if you are giving someone you are giving the person out of the benevolence of your mm. heart like you don't not as if you have enough but you just want yeah. help so but anything you just we nigerians we've developed this um should i call it shock absorber that anything that happened we just go with it severe. yeah we, we just roll with it and we just want to make ourselves happy that's why when we had the afcon mm. everybody was happy because mm. until we now lose <laughs> so but now make yourself happy if you are married Enjoy your husband, though. Enjoy your family. <laughs> enjoy well, if you are single, wow. Wow. let all of us stay together and make ourselves <laughs> happy. You know, it's true now. It's true. Because right now, you need to uh, derive... Just a way. Yeah, you need to derive find that inner joy. That make you happy. Inner joy for yourself so that mm. you can still keep your head straight Absolutely. and up. That's just yeah. it. So, I'm grateful for life. Maybe yeah. that's what's making me happy because... I have to look for a nigeria to do wedding this period nice right <laughs> yeah, but that is not looking like that on you at all you're exactly. looking beautiful. oh wow thank like god for real, beautiful let me top yeah my baby mama Aww. how are you doing i'm fine we'll do i'm just trying to muster that courage to say i'm fine mm. well i i shortly before we came here i was really down thinking about if things are this hard, yeah. you know, around me, mm. or if I myself am, you know, experiencing some difficulties yeah. with things that I used to do freely, yeah. then how much more other people out there in the streets, you know, people that were really, you know, even Indeed. looking up to me. But, I mean, it's one of the reasons why I like to come on the show with you ladies, yeah, because, because it's a latent moment for me. Mm. And it takes me away from the harsh realities of things like, out yeah. there. So, uh, if I say that I'm fine, I'm just really hoping to be fine. Because I think about how things are. And I'm just hoping that things will get better. Uh, it will. Amen. It's the hope. I'm really yeah. hoping. So, mm. we all need to keep the hopes alive. Yeah, so we, we need to. I mean, we started on renewed hope. So we need to keep on renewing our hope. Exactly. <laughs> like, that's exactly. 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 I mean, that's the word we need right now. Mm -hmm. Renew your hopes every daily, morning. Every just... morning. Mm -hmm. You know, those hopes have to be new every, every morning. morning. Because so, yeah. by the end of the day, it has already yeah, diminished. Right. So when you wake up, you need to feel it. Feel it bad. Like yeah, you true. need to recharge overnight to have a full bar on it's your It's amazing hopes. to have you guys on the show Thank today, ladies. We'll go on a quick break, and then when we come back, we'll be discussing the topic of the day. The ladies talk show now we'll be discussing about something that probably has to do with the word fetish because you get the fact that a lot of people have different fetishes whether they like you know they are told to be sucked they like their <laughs> anus to be sucked they like to be choked they like the bdsm like to be different things that people like but then this is a weird one that you know it's not really head of but then mm. it's a fetish it's something that somebody likes now mm. this girl is actually sending an email and she's asking for help and she says my boyfriend enjoys the sense of bushy and smelly armpits. I met this guy on Facebook <laughs> and we started talking. <laughs> <laughs> Judy, please. <laughs> I met this guy on Facebook and we started talking. He told me his likes, and one of them I quote is, I like sweaty armpits. He said that, and he said something about not shaving and never washing the armpits. Mm. I can bait any other part of my body, but I'm not allowed to bait my armpits. He came to Nigeria in November and we've been together since then. He puts his nose on my armpits while sleeping. During sex, he eats both the hairs, the death, <laughs> and the sweat. Now, I secretly washed my armpits about three weeks of no washing, and he got angry. He said it's a turn off. Now, apart from this, according to this lady, he's a nice guy. What do you think of this addiction? Are you serious? Oh, God. Uh, but he's a nice guy, no? <laughs> when like shop, that, that, that's only flaw. When they shop and <laughs> that's, that's as we only like, flaw. Ah, <laughs> you know, you need to take some people for psychological disease. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking for the word. Comprehensive no, see, the, mental. The thing is, would, would you Check really up. say because somebody has a fetish, the person is mentally imbalanced? See. <laughs> it could just be, you know, somebody was saying the other time that anybody that likes to be choked or likes BDSM has experienced some trauma in the past, which is not true. All right. It could just be that, okay, you just like this act of, you know, doing this thing during sex. It's just, this is painful pleasure. You know, a mosquito bites you and you're scratching it and it's pinning you, but it's yeah. giving you pleasure at the same yeah. time. Like, yeah. that kind of vibe. Does yeah. he shave his own too? Or he leaves his own? I like don't that. know. Because well, I wouldn't know. No, because but I, that, it's not something that, that she likes, really so he doesn't necessarily need to do it for her. Exactly. 
none of that really matters because there are some things that are norms and there are some things that are abnormal depending in our on you today. not depending. I feel like you're going to check this according to your own standard because who says it's norm and who says it's abnormal because you Cassie. between the points of them because you he, he, he's a nice guy are you getting that but the love of my life he treats her well, treats her like a queen, okay. takes good care of her. Mm -hmm. And the only one thing he's saying is, don't shave your arm. Is that too much to ask for? Don't have me. people out there ah. who don't shave their armpits. When you see a person walking with their heads, what will you do? You with will stay. That That's is their personal business. Walking actually. with their heads oh. and their legs up. You up can't there. compare the two. We can't. You actually cannot. I was trying to tell you that there are some things that are normal. And there are some things that are abnormal. abnormal really absurd ah. that is weird and should i think the person needs a mental evaluation there's no there's no negotiating that we, we really. see you. yeah see you mm. yes check it too yes picture i know okay. that you have this imaginative <laughs> memory but okay so picture i'm you. with you ah. <laughs> <laughs> see it's a thing to Stop like it's, it's a, a thing so, no, no. Do you act with you know this period <laughs> you, 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 <laughs> so somebody ah. on that day you now raise up your hand. <laughs> you make you come and then ring your armpit oh with the sweat. With ah, no, no, cause you, cause you some Do you know that, that there are some times that no, even no. you are disgusted with the? Were you disgusted? I'm with wait, your. Wait. I know your fetish. You're different. But yeah. this is no. this is this is way overboard. This is way overboard. But this if, is, and if, it's unhygienic. And if this is the it's one thing that is at all. all off from her i wouldn't say it's over but i would say it's understandable it's seeing understandable the, seeing as the fact that he's a nice guy and he treats her because, because she knows because, because he's not be beating her now okay. so okay that's not because, because that's not she normal. knows that it's not understandable that's why it's if out guy, there if this guy was it's because she wants to know how to love him better See, so if this guy was a nigerian of this addition. if this guy was a nigerian i would have said maybe he's using it for sons but it's not i'm not sure he's a nigerian right he probably is because she said he just came back to nigeria i mean maybe he was Based maybe abroad, and okay. he has maybe. Come back to Nigeria. so because I can't, I, I really just can't wrap my head around the fact that someone who has such a fetish, like first of all, you're you're taking in something that is not even healthy to your body, because he's he's talking it at me. He's eating, he's eating. <laughs> During sex, he he's he's he so when he's sleeping, he likes to sleep in no bed. So like you you you're endangering your health because I know that for the health health wise, I'm I'm not I'm sure. That, that in my has a side. I don't I'm very it. sorry, but uh, you know, if, from my own perspective, oh, that that lady has met a ritualist. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's no one. And she and she said he's a nice person. <laughs> oh, she just know. met a ritualist. That's what I was asking. So if he's a Nigerian, or not to maybe ask. if he's a Nigerian. To be honest with you, do you know this man would grow old at the end of the day, have some kind of diseases, something yes. that, in fact, the doctors might not even be able to fathom but how because they have been eating so many years. But then again, because this is. This Many of us have dated, you know, before her. But you know, so you know, there's this thing that people are doing now, women are doing, where they are embracing their natural selves. Because oh, we, see, we see a lot of men who don't shave their armpits, right? Cassie, but they yes. no chill. But, chill. They wash it. but you know, when a, when a woman does that, it's looked at as disgusting. Why are mm. you as a woman having armpit hairs? So now a lot of women out there are embracing themselves and saying, okay, I'm going to rock my armpit hairs and I don't care what it is that you but do. I did read in a place that mm. yeah, they do wash you it. might leave your hair and you might shave it, depending on your, mm. on your comfortability with yes. that. Yes. But it has to be clean. clean. That's the point. That's the point. But then it has to be clean for even you. How much more another person? And I'm like, stop eating. Eat it. No, the no, thing you is, you know, I, I feel eating. eating is very, it's very, it's very. I think English. this no. lady would definitely. You know, the thing now is, I think this man needs to understand that this lady has a life too. You understand now? Yeah. I, I understand that she is trying to, you know, want to know him better. Want to. Make sure that he is also comfortable in the relationship. After all, it's, you know, mm -hmm. I give me, I give you, you know, feedback yeah. and, and all of that. So yes, we understand that scenario, painting it as per relationship. Mm. But then again, what happens when she goes out there? If she wants to take public yes. transport, and she, she wants to do some that. stuff. Oh, people, you people do people know that even be noticing at this it point, it might be difficult. Because she granted it in the first, first place. place. You compromised no, on no, things no, no. that are she not said, compromised She upon. said when she wanted to go back to the normal... Yeah, he got he, he got that he he got got and For he someone might. like me, that would be a ton of... Because, see, if it was just bushy, hmm, I would understand that, okay, bushy. But smelly, like, 
She wouldn't. Have she did not dirty. wash for like three weeks. Three and weeks. do you know what it means? She and you're not putting um because even if you're adding because he likes the smell or, so you... or um, perspirant, it you you need to wash it See. to add a new one because if no now class is a no no, no, no. Okay. that you, 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 you even know. tried because for me if I don't go crazy. You no, know, I'm really curious now. Did you? I know you guys could want to hide this from us, but I really implore you to be yeah. open with the okay. audience right now. Do you guys have any fetish that you? No, I don't. Do? You sure? I don't. Hmm. Okay, what about you, Judith? Do you I'm have any fetish? Think, but I don't think I have. One. How is it possible that you Except guys don't have want one to fetish? sit and start going back, that and back, and like, back, and back to be done to you one thing that turns you on in a man that might you know be somewhat abnormal she the kissy and the kissy that's not a fetish that's not a fetish ah, okay let, let, let's leave it because none of you have fetishes no, i'm trying to think and the only thing i can think of is maybe kissing on my neck no cassie or maybe, we are very I, conventional no, because, women because i don't, we don't think have fetishes. i have any weird thing maybe i would not say somebody uh, kiss my like, toes okay but if you were to meet somebody who has a fetish though would you be open to if that I it to meet that kind of a man i would run in the opposite direction not that particular one let's say you meet someone who tells you he likes bdsm he likes you to spank him he wants to spank you i still wants to consider you. that i'm still grappling are you with open that? to that no i'm not because just I'm choking, still no. trying to grab it's that. just choking, it's not killing Can't you. Can't kill you, girl. It's well, not there, just the press it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's not going to do it like that. You, okay. know, you, you never know, you never can come at any time. <laughs> Maybe he's enjoying this now, and you're starting. <laughs> you know, you know, you know. <laughs> Have, you know, several, crazy fetish. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yes, I know. They like to have their toes soft, soft and all know. of that. The so I, I've actually, I've actually even read of people who tell their babes, like, when you go out during the day, mm. you've done your sweating, you've done your daily activities, I don't want you to wash up before I go down on you because they want to maintain that musty smell. They like that musty smell that the vagina oozes out. So mm. People like that. So people have different fetishes. So people, I, I've read of scenarios where after going to the toilet, the man will tell the babe, don't wipe, babe. He wants to smell yeah. them. He turns them on. My God. For real. You've not heard of people that go to Dubai and they have to put into someone's mouth or eat someone's yeah, because I, it's like a fetish for them and they pay you away for it. Oh people God. have several different fetishes. This one, yes. So I wouldn't really yes. say that man, you're getting better. No, no. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so I was still going to come back to the not so funny part. We've yeah. made, you know, light of the issue yeah. and we've laughed, but we really need to come back to the more sensible things. <laughs> This thing, this kind of guy, the first thing he needs is mental evaluation. Because I don't think he is really all right. And some of these things, we don't get them out here in Nigeria. Just like we don't see You'd be some surprised. of this. No, we do. You'll be surprised. Just like we don't we do see some of this, um, um, what's it called? Natural disasters around here. Yeah. Yeah. We have flooding. We have some, we might, you know, experience well, earthquake if possible. But that's what I'm also saying. There are some of these things that are not really from around here. Mm. When you go out there, see, when you travel and travel, then you're bound to come back changed. God bless you for that word. Rubbish, refurbished. Rubbish. Please drop your refurbished self. When time you're coming back home, come back to our ladies. Normal. Our men, normal. Mm. Drop the abnormalities <laughs> no. and the not so no. sane things around I, I here. Think that, drop them wherever it is you pick I, them. I feel because that, really, this guy, that's terrible. There's something we're not but looking the, into. The thing is, you guys are not getting it. He's not saying go and kill somebody. He's not saying send me your nude pictures. He's not asking for drastic You might as well have killed me, he, he loves her. It's hard for you Take to find someone us, that yeah. loves you, right? Yes, in I this know. present generation, yes, somebody who truly loves you from the depth of his heart, but I should be who is not up cheating and you. all of that. <laughs> and all he's saying is that I, I have this fetish and, for you. and I want you to help me satisfy it. So that simply don't love shave you, and don't wa <laughs> wash don't every other so part. That so speaks wait, love to you, Cassie. But you know, great for sure. So a guy should come now. Let's not take it too far. But let's not take it too far. Mm. What brings about body odor is not it, it, it's not is mostly from the armpit first mm. because I don't understand because that's why when you want to smell someone that has body odor when you think they go they, they go to the armpit yeah but hold on 
you know we've met people who have body odor, right? When we enter buses, we enter vehicles, yeah. we them. Don't you think people have love of their lives? They have. Don't they have people that love them? So what are you saying? So, so she so, could go around so, smelling, right? But say somebody that loves love, her. Oh, that's the most important thing. You are smelling for me. And you are being yeah, loved by yourself. Be, as you are saying, she has body odor. You are not believing yourself. If you tell her she has body odor. Because if you were to meet a man, who would tell you? Because you love to glam. Yeah. If you were to meet a man, so you would tell you to drop all the glands. Ah, it depends. Like, it depends. You go glam and you show. Sure. That's exactly that's what that's your brand just you said. Glam. Glam. Maybe that lady now is in the, the lamb line, but maybe she's going for an MBCA, and she will glam to me and be smelly. She could say that's her brand. Who knows? Oh, oh my oh, brand is oh, My oh, brand is smelly, <laughs> squishy, <laughs> and pink. Oh, yeah, yeah, I love that. Come to signature. I think I want to agree with Tokwe right now. Cassie is not even convinced with this thing. Yeah. She cannot believe it. But funny enough, you know, all this thing starts from little. Yeah. I feel that guy, maybe while growing up, he loves um, rotting things. Mm. And maybe growing up, you know, as an adult, you can't be keeping rotting things around. Yeah. He now looks, he now, now he's not looking for a human being that will help him keep the rotting things. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> so because really, I don't know, you know, fetish is built from something. It doesn't. Somebody, nobody just wakes habit, up. Oh, nobody yeah. just wakes up and have this crazy fetish. Maybe for some. Okay, let's say for instance now for some I, ladies. I, I probably this fetish is built from decided, terrible fantasies that you have. Wait, I'm not going to say that. that because, yeah. But I have a particular fetish, and it just randomly happened. Nothing led up to maybe, it. No, no maybe, trauma. No trauma you, caused it. Mm. I'm not going to mention a fetish now. It's maybe there are some ladies. You should. Maybe, 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 because I really maybe, need to. Maybe, maybe, so maybe, maybe, there are some, there are some, there are some ladies. Maybe there are some ladies who like um to do act like a man, even while their man is there. They like to be dominate. Like dominate. Really dumb, yeah. yeah. There are some ladies who like to um their fetish is to just. They are not lesbians in a way, but they feel their man should drink it. They are, they are crazy fetish. Mm. But, but it does not involve you smelling. <laughs> now, what if three of you now, okay, you're already taken, you know, you've got a man, you've got, you've got a fiance, people evolve, right? Yeah. So what happens if within the course of your marriage, your man evolves mm. and decides that we make that he likes to smell his <laughs> <mental> <laughs> Guys, one by one. Yeah. Nengi, would you leave the marriage? Your man involves mm -hmm. and tells you, okay, babe, I think I've developed this certain fetish where I don't want you to take your baits and your appetite, lady bush and all of that. He, he, this is the love of your life. The father that of your way, children. That kind of who has not do like, not no say that. Say that. Yes, do not. You know, you know. <laughs> say normally, man, they say we evolu uh, we we you evolutionalize, have evolved evolve yeah. from if. Mm. Mm. So, <laughs> wait, <laughs> are we not saying that we are not going back? <laughs> back. So, so the yeah. evolution, <laughs> the left and edge. No, that be evolution. I mean, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. So what we no, do in Like, real life scenario, if that happens. The man no back. Mm. <laughs> 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 the man no back. Ah! See, Cassie, Cassie, yeah. there are some things, eh? That is, in fact, now better divorce ground be that. <laughs> you leave the marriage for that. Ross! Just it. that one what? act, though. No, just one act. That one act. Tell him that. To be honest, okay, okay. To be honest with you, to be honest with you, no, to be honest with you. Now, normally, that's the first thing you would even think of. Maybe get to tell somebody what is going on. Just like this lady has come out to say, get to tell somebody <laughs> what is going on. And if you feel like hmm. these advices are not helping, hmm. because it is also detrimental to your to health. health. Let's not forget that these are two people who. It's just because, okay, we are partners, right? We know. But we have different destinies to fulfill. I cannot be smelling <laughs> like fufu or something to be fulfilling like that. No! I can't do that. You have to change. <laughs> like, we will take you mountain. <clears throat> well, I'm praying for you. Ah. Probably you are possessed. Or let's even take, <laughs> let's, let's even uh, look at this lady's case yeah. now. I was thinking, maybe this guy was an inmate. Hmm. Probably he was arrested, went to prison. You understand? And that's how he developed but they, they do wait in the prisons. Right? I know they do, but probably that's just what they happened decide to him. not to nobody. Maybe, now, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I was just thinking, as Jimmy was, I was just thinking that probably this guy mm. might have been an ex-convict or you no, know, an inmate. You know, somebody that spent maybe years in the cell. Oh, he did and, survivors. You know, it just, he just survivors. <laughs> developed <laughs> that stuff. So we we don't even know. To be to be honest with you, we're not even sure yeah, here about, about this guy's psychology, uh, psychology, and what brought. 
about, about it. it. So I'm, I'm feeling like probably he might have been an ex-convict or something. And <laughs> are you just, saying just, this is grounds for divorce? Now yes. Let me ask you, Lita Hannah. No. If your man, your mm -hmm. husband, who yeah. you've, you know, had children with, you know, down 10 years, 20 years down mm -hmm. the line, he tells you he has developed a fetish and doesn't want you to shave your armpits and doesn't want you to bath that area, how would you react? We will carry and go pray. We will go pray. One day more, we will not know where to come for that time. Yes, but <laughs> where I will do, I will go 30 days. Yeah, we will pray. See, Cassie, yeah. it's different because I can't just leave my home, pack up and leave normally. I'll speak to someone <laughs> if the person is not good. You see that was my who did who did now? I will not. Is you with us or come or all of? Shall who did now? So we will be there. Seriously, I won't leave that home for anything because of it. And I will and not. He's telling and you, I will not. Spend. That is the only way he can get to have you know. Shall we don't go? Marital activities with you. Uh, but then how will that pleasure anybody when he's not sleeping with you? You're not sleeping with him because you're not doing things that will turn uh, him on. No worry. So you're living like a sexless marriage. Male mm -hmm. they do. Male they do. That's like she, marriage that's not. She will never born finish. We don't go. Serious now. Because Cassie, I, mean, I will not sleep for him. Even aside for fetish clinical, there and are marriages that see. There are marriages that as we speak. Yeah. It is sexless marriage, just like you call it. Just like they have not, children. But then what's the joy in that? Where is the joy? There's so much joy. Even without that, there's so much joy. And you see, so like so 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 love is the absence of one will for the good of another. If he knows, and he's a man, and the Bible says the man should love. If he knows that this stupid fetish is not uh, working with me, and he loves me, he would stop it. See, the way the fetish take on, hmm? mm. if he use and go. It's mm. just a mindset. It is it's your mind. It's it is your, truly a mindset. It's a mindset. Yes. Yes. The way you build your mind is the way you can take your mind off things. Just like some of us, some of us have some crazy fantasy. Some of us want to do four songs. Let mm. two girls be here. Let's be kissing one girl, <laughs> kissing mm. another girl. But because it's a mindset, it's a mind thing. Mm. You imagine it and you take your mind off it. So with fetish things, all this rubbish fetish thing, it, it is a mindset. If you don't like it, the person don't like it, you come out for your head. Nobody, nobody do all that thing. Right? So, me and I live by husband, because I should be smelling. Well, I will not smell in the house. I will, be, I will still be fine. And I will be very short, short, skirt up and down. <laughs> if you like, no, no. <laughs> okay, so Tope, what would you do? Well, I know that presently, whenever I see or stumble on a movie, that has LGBTQ mm. in it, I tune it off immediately. Mm. Now, it's no offense to you, but it is an offense to me. Mm. Mm. Now, you don't want to be offended. I do not much. want to contaminate my mind. Mm. Mm. I have self preservation and I have to preserve my mind. Mm. And I have a very young infant mind that I'm grooming. Mm. Yeah. It's very, very important to keep my environment safe of all those things. Now, coming back to the issue at hand. I do not believe in all of those. And for that fact, I will not do the bidding of my husband for the first time. Yes, I wouldn't. Mm. Or my, my boyfriend or whatever it is mm. that we're practicing to. I won't. Because I believe well, I, I sincerely. Are you guys supposed to be I submissive believe. to your husband? Submit the smell. I mean, you want to submit the smell. But you're supposed you to be submissive. So if your husband yeah. is telling you, now you see the 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 so why should you not do that? And he's not smelling you know. no. Cassie, the submissive part, the submissive part, is where you try to understand with him and try to want to have a conversation with him around it. Around it. Let's find a way. A solution. Let's, yes, People let's will find put a way. Let's really you find a way. Yeah, maybe we'll put you Are you saying, I don't want to do it, but let's no, find a way. No, that's it. We're partners, right? We're partners now. We're partners. It doesn't have to. Everything doesn't partners, have to come from one person. Partners, but he's still your head, right? I know. Everything doesn't have to come from one person. You don't need to drop it on bad smoke. We're coming at this. No, I really can wrap my head around it. We'll look for what brought about that. We say like what he's meant. Yeah. Maybe when we want to make love, we we'll look at rotten <laughs> fish. We saw the water and put close to his nose. <laughs> so when he smells it, <laughs> we're satisfied. We're satisfied. Shame, no, shame. No, no. That's no, that's it. This is being trying something. to, try to, to find a solution, a solution to that. Mm. And she is rotten. You want to be smelling rotten, rotten since I be. Mm. And no matter. It's not bad now. It's not a good thing. But a do you even know you can go extra mile? Oh. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, but. <laughs> But you want to deal with a very, very somewhat insane person. Yeah. You need to be insane as well. <laughs> <laughs> because, okay, when you keep rice water for long, yeah, it, it smells. smells. So maybe, just in the spirit of compromise, yeah. 
whenever we we they want to be together. So she takes it down and she rubs it. Smite around oh. the armpit so he could have his own way. Mm. Then after we, I really need to have a bath. What's that? <laughs> Because okay. Okay. So we're looking for compromise. Exactly. We have to compromise. You want to smell it, but, but yeah, it's not fish. You don't keep fish. That's you just a piece of advice for the lady. You see that no. is described as a nice man for her. It mm. fits her own dictionary of nice. Of nice. Mm. But for me, that's a no go area. In fact, first thing in the morning, you're going for mental evaluation, see, a very comprehensive Cassie. one. And if nothing works, we'll take it for deliverance. If that does not work, <laughs> then it's ground for deliverance. But the I think now, I stand with they Nigeria have that. a rotting smell. They have spray. That's when yeah. you see all like the fat smell and yeah. mm. prank videos. Are you serious? Yes, yeah. they do. Fat smell, rotting smell, all those prank videos. So I feel this lady, so that we don't, she doesn't lose a good man like she mm. says. A nice mm. man. A nice man. Mm. But um, whenever he's around, she just carry it, spray on the armpit. Yeah. Let him chop the this thing. <laughs> what if no, no, but you know he will still be angry it is because smell. she, she would want to not be yeah. there. Exactly. It not be there. If it's not it, it's not it. No, it's not. He's used to a particular seen, type of smell. You see those brand videos. If you see the fat smell, you know. No, there are different, 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 different types smells. of bad smells. Make the spray for the armpit. Judith, huh? there are different types of bad smells. There's urine smell when you pour your body. There's a different smell when you pour your body. There's a different smell. So it might be that he's. Addicted to one particular type of smell. See, and then that so one, that what one happens? Him so then we the one that's involved. They what? have rapid smell. They what what, what, what would that Check happen up. if he's used to this particular smell? Yeah. And probably their relationship don't last long. They break up. And she starts shaking it to the next smell. No. And, she and he gets it. to the next lady. Mm. So what are you saying? He's used to this one. So does it mean that he will be cheating or something at the end of no, the day because he's used no, to one thing? No, you know what will happen? That's, 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 it's, that's it's, such it's a great not... point. It means he's not even going to cheat because which other lady aside from her? No, I'm talking about when they break up. No, I'm talking about when they break up. Let's just yeah. say when they break up totally. Yeah. Yeah. This guy and this girl have broken up. Mm. And he needs to move on. He needs to date another you girl. You find someone else that would do it for him. No, this smell. That particular flavor has changed. Rotten and different Thank you. That particular flavor has changed. That has been tasted for how many years I now? like that. It's, it's, it's just the way we have people cooking jello fries. We different. love jello fries, but mm. there are different ways of jello fries, right? But different jello things, fries. Yeah. So I don't think it's going to mind. It, it okay. will. It's going to be sweet jello fries for him. Mind. <laughs> it might affect him at the long run. Well, well, I, I, okay, I, I know there's no other way around it. Lot. The but this is not let's, let's just give like a final advice in 30 seconds for this lady because truly speaking she loves this guy okay it's difficult to just leave someone mm, you love at the end yeah. of the day it's a difficult thing yeah. and now that he's hard to see who well, loves you well yeah so what do you right. think you should do in a, in a world seconds. that is really really devoid of love and you know people are not really throwing love around mm. anymore so just stick with your own love <laughs> it's your own definition. <laughs> Try to cook the flavors as a word to them. Since you're comfortable <laughs> with that. <laughs> All right, Judith, what do you think? I <laughs> feel you should um go on Google um look for smelling armpit sprays. <laughs> no, I'm serious. Yeah. They're, no, they have it. Mm. You get it. Look for smelling armpit sprays and get one. Go to Amazon. Then they have this. Then spray it on your armpit when it's around. Mm. Just put it there. Mm. So when he wants to eat. You eat well and <laughs> all right, Lenny. Please, ten seconds. Run for your life. <laughs> Run for your life. You just met a mutualist. He's not you. Run for your life and make sure that maybe once in a while you would want to check on him and see if. Oh, to be honest, run for your life, please. <laughs> no. All right, no. it's been such an amazing one. We'll go on a quick break and then when we come back, we'll be discussing what's trending. So don't go nowhere. Turn it up! It's the Wild Wild West. And Western Spring Television is pulling out all the stops to make sure that you don't miss out on every of the fun and happenings around you. Yup, we've got you covered because your girls got all the juiciest tidbits and entertainment news from around the world. Cross over to the chocolatey side of entertainment. Join me, Chocolate Cassie, on Eccentric as we take you into every bit of the juiciest news, fashion, music, movie updates, and other trendy conversations. Together on the show, we'll get personal with your favorite celebrities via phone call, Zoom, or even live here in the studio. 
8th century could be shown on your TV screen on Western Spring Television Channel 190 only on Star Prime. Welcome back to the Ladies Talk Show. Now, we are going to talk about something that's been trending on the internet. You know, we talk about the fact that people should be free to wear whatever they want, yeah. live your life, live your freedom. And it seems as if the society or the many society are not going for anybody this year. Mm -hmm. Because I came across a video, two videos actually that I put together of men that have been harassing these ladies. I think this is even something that you can be sued for, actually. But it's something that they are doing. They country? are getting away with it. <laughs> it should be in this country, but it's not being done. Let's take a, let's take a quick look at the video and then we'll come back to discuss it. <laughs> Wala deo. Almost naked. Ah, Nigeria don't scatter. See the person where come back. Hey, we. Ah. Hold on. 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 These are ladies who have decided to embrace their, you know, their feminism. Feminism. <laughs> yeah. I go. I feel I like <laughs> at a point in time, you should be allowed to wear what you want to wear, right? Is there really anything that can be liberated as doing so much? Are you serious? Oh, Cassie. For real. Because she decided to go to the bank. She was not going for an interview. I need to ask you, Cassie. She was not going to the job. In what country? She was not going to the box. Did you see it? She was just wearing Cassie her clothes. Did you see that? What country is now, that, Now, the Cassie? second guy... Mm -hmm. The second guy, he, he crossed the line. There should be boundaries. You might not be mm. comfortable with what somebody is wearing, yeah. Mm. But in the video is like six minutes long. I just showed you guys 59 seconds of it. He went ahead to take bottle water and pour on her. Don't you think that's harassment? No Clean matter water. what it is, that even if she came out naked, he wants to clean her. Yeah. Even if she came out <laughs> naked. <laughs> Cassie. Hey. Yeah. Cassie. This is succulent. Okay, so you somebody have a lot to say. Uh, I have more than enough. All hey, right. Let's hear it. Oh. Let's have it. Yesterday, I I read that uh, I read some things about Morocco. But mm. one thing that stood out was Morocco has is the only country that has mm. women's rights enshrined in their constitution. Okay. Mm. You see, whether we like it or not, the thing is, we will never stop emphasizing the the importance of morality and decency Bam. no matter what mm. see this is not uk this is not the us those places freedom is given even up to the point of naked insanity don't naked yourself the worker we need to when we need to say mm. some truth we do not need to fear anything mm. or any just anything see this is nigeria if this were to happen in nigeria that guy is right but right. we need to draw a line. He's right. Yes. He By spraying water on our body. He is. He's yes. doing that with he our content. If you need to draw it's holy water. If you need to draw another drop another thing on her, but you should. By God, our parents did not treat us that way. I mean, did not teach us that. Hmm. They did not raise us like that. Hmm. How would you come into the society looking like that? Why did she call the they cover herself? For heaven's 
since you were This was being reviewed and she was drawing it. Why is she drawing it? Don't come out naked. Let's know that, yes. No, you're naked. I'm going to be specially designed to cover her hair. Now, while she was arguing, it was shifting. So she just took it back to the former position. It's not that deep. And the thing was still pointing, though. It's not that deep. See, whether you like it or not, like me, hate me, whatever, be in the middle. The point is, I will never stand for that. This is Nigeria. I need my children to grow in... Do you know sometimes when we talk about this jackba jackba, I discuss that with my husband almost all the time. But some things really give me a headache and give me, you know, restlessness whenever I'm thinking of, okay, maybe jackba might not be a bad thing after all. But sometimes it is a bad thing. Sometimes you just listen to all of these news that scare you about killing spree. Mm, yeah. What happened here? Don't just come and that is a place where you talk about depression all of the time. Mm. Yes. They have hospitals for that. You could practically walk in on a doctor. Yeah. Walk into a doctor. So you're saying office. we don't have depression and in Nigeria? So, no. That's what I'm saying. In this economy. You could practically go <laughs> in there, into the hospital, tell the doctor you are feeling depressed, or and maybe your you. husband did something, it's really weighing on your mind, and you have a comprehensive and a detailed conversation with yeah. the doctor. Here. On my show, the doctor was saying, even the doctor you are going to meet is depressed. is depressed. And so when you go with frivolities like that, it's considered like that here. Because we're not practicing the kind of medicine mm. they are practicing. When you go, they see you as being maybe outrageous or something. Okay, If you don't have your money to do, to, you don't have any other thing to do with your money, give it to someone who needs it more. Because when we, and so why I said that is because there, you could easily walk into a doctor's office and speak and talk about your emotions, how you're feeling. And people would not see you as strange or weird. Yeah. But right here, we'll still that see you as weird. That doesn't take away from so, the fact that what that guy did is wrong. And I'm you're saying, saying it is right. You're saying he had every right to afford what's on her because of what she was wearing. Yes. I mean, he could have simply said to her, babe, I don't like what you're wearing. Don't wear this next time. Oh, Kuku, remove his face. She... See, like for real, you, we can't the other side. No, we cannot keep doing that. She knows what she's wearing is so wrong. So she has, he has to go as far as harassing her by point. He was should her harass out. her. I think we need to get to that point again. But it's before nobody's we business. Start, it is everybody. You should it actually, is my be, you should actually be jailed and When for I that. have a child and you are trying to jeopardize the destiny of that child by coming out in the street looking so like pour water on now, I will yeah. pour more than water on you. Yeah. Believe water. me sincerely, <laughs> I'm saying that. <laughs> Don't go out there yeah. looking like that. Hmm. Well, let's bring up back our morality. I saw a decency. I saw a picture. Was it a V? It was a picture about a child. The child should be about six years. And you are having padded hips for the child. You're having corset <laughs> on the child. The child was wearing a train, a train outfit. Hmm. I mean, what are you putting in the heads of your six-year-old children? Hmm. What are you putting out there in this the street? This is a mother talking. For real. For like, real. I she got the mother with the side of her. You know, you see, you see my now, children. the thing is, and when you go out there looking like that, I will even beat you off the streets. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. You're going to chew it off it. No, let's, 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 <laughs> even take it from, let's even take it from this aspect. Yeah. Now. You see this gear? Mm. Now, what well, this in there showing all our succulency and yeah. everything. <laughs> everything just stand there. Everything just... If you want and to go... And I don't want to stand there. No, say that that thing now. This small thing don't need. Now, yeah. Ah, this society self. This girl mm. with the one that was at the bank that wore. I didn't know. I didn't see what, what that, that is. is. What mm. that was? She wore nothing. She wore a very short bum shirt. A very that short. That one I bought. A very short. You make sure she had bum shirt. That one was bum shirt. I didn't see bum shirt. That's what she wore. That one she wore. You know, there's a kind of bum shirt that allows your butt cheeks to show. Yeah, yeah. That's what she was wearing. Exactly. The funny thing is, you see these two people on a Sunday. They will go show. and check how they dress to church. They go wear exactly. long clothes. And some churches and more. and check oh God. how they dress. They but there is a time and place for everything. They are not expected to wear this to church. This some is not church. Do. They are not even so expected why, why, to wear this. Some people wear. do. Why, why I don't think anybody will be wearing this to church. church. Some people kind of do. Eye. Why are you looking at the church? It's a holy eye. place. Okay. The bank is not a holy place. No, the bank is the, not a holy place. The bus park is not a holy and place. And there are people that are if in that are that are holy. I mean, she didn't tell you she's a Christian, no. did she? If you are a confirmed Christian, because, no, I'm very no, sure they are Christians. No, they are Christians. I mean, she didn't say so. No, they are Christians. She might not be religious. She might not be a child goer. That's why they're always coming for Christians. And they say, God checks your heart, right? You always see Christians. So who are we to attack you? So we are to attack you. It is the same Bible. She should have told you that. Your it is that same Bible that you want to be quoting that said 
present your bodies a living sacrifice holy hmm. and acceptable unto God. See, that's your that is not present present your your body. Body. You, you don't open see, the food you want to give to a king. You cover it up. Hmm. My people, God is a people king. Leave, most people leave you a don't, contrast you don't do life. that. It's very clear. If you ask me, you see that like exactly. Exactly. you're going to be precious. Like this. Grace. <laughs> no, Sarah. I'm sure. I'm telling you. Oh. See, oh, you can't see. Whenever funny enough, you can't see. I won't. See, let's be no, for, no, let's no. be frank. Mm. You won't actually see eh? why we said it was Christians is because most times we Christians we tend to do that a lot. You won't actually see Where it. Where you want to see the other religion? They dress I'm like telling this. you, you won't see the other religion. God bless you. Because that's why they always come. I see them. Because, because I was about mentioning Christianity, much, but then I stopped. Yo, short. That's why they, they always never attack Christianity that. a lot. Because we Christians we always say. God, don't look my heart. Mm. You know, no, don't look my, you look my body. No, don't look my heart. my, na my yeah. heart. They look. See, if you, if I know, no. as in, I can bet on my life that those ladies weren't trained were born that in a way. Christian. They were not trained home. that way. They were not dressed up in that way because these are ladies that are grown by normal yeah, our, our adults, parents. So exactly. they were not trained or dressed enough because now if they rape you, you go talk say why exactly. they rape. Uh, 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 let's not do that. No, no, let's, no, let's not. Let's not. What we are never going to do is this victim. Which one? No, 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 no. We will do that. We will do that. We will do that. Do you know there's no reason whatsoever? Do you know there are men that are We are not going to blame the straps of a bra. Well, you want to get to the husband. So, but somebody being raped, he doesn't have to do what you're wearing. No, he has to be the person who is insane. So, let's not do that. See, we always talk about the fact that there are no excuses or justification for some of these things. Right. We will also talk and emphasize on the fact that when you want to get your husband at night, they tell you to wear seductive materials. Yeah, why? Exactly. They tell you why? to wear exposing materials. Why? But also out there in the street, we have men. You also have to be disciplined as a man too. Oh, because yes, you have to. Because you have to. What is the point of the discipline? Like she said, because you could that literally, literally that, 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 Do you know there are men that get sedges by seeing ankles? So would you say every lady out there should cover their ankles because of this man? Cassie, calm down. No. See, you know, one, yes. Pouring her, just like maybe he poured that. Let's just say maybe he poured her sand. Pouring her water, <laughs> eh? Fine. He shouldn't have. There are ways to do things. You know, go here, yeah, what? Maybe pour water. Fix, there are ways you know, to do yeah. things. Because it's going to stop her. I know, I know, yeah. I know that she one thing is spicy. Tomorrow. She may not do it again. I know tomorrow, one thing is spicy. Spicy is the fundamental woman right of a person. Exactly. Because yes, no matter what, no, no matter what, you should not harass mm. anybody. There are some cases whereby there are. I'm sh don't harass anybody, don't because it's none of your business, right? But this is Africa. Mm. See, this is Africa. This is Nigeria for crying out loud. There is this moral um lifestyle we mm. uphold in this country that even our four forefathers or our mothers make sure we uphold this. And that's why sometimes we import some things that are, that when we Nigerians seem like mm. ah, ah, it don't too much exactly. now. Exactly. I'm sure that guy has gotten to a point of you don't too much. Was it right to pour her water? In some cases, some people will say yes, some people will say no. Do you understand? So it's it's based on everybody's opinion. But I feel what the lady is putting on is something that she shouldn't have. Of course, she's revealing, like, there's nothing we cannot see again. Hmm. The breast is there. What if one man come now open the breast? Is so. <laughs> Why would a man want to open the breast? Why would he 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 open the
a lady will dress so seductively outside that you will see that you will see one or two bulge. men. Exactly. No matter how disciplined mm. he is, I some men will just. Mm. Face if you want to get around, face and as, around and go to your house and you are around. What if, what if as that lady is dressed like that and we don't know, a man will just be telling her, all because he has been aroused sexually because of her outfit. He'll just be trailing and her at the end of the day. Her till he gets to a very quiet place and she gets raped, mm. which is not supposed to be so. Which is not an excuse for which rape. Which is not an excuse for rape. But there are triggers. And what I'm, I'm, I'm more concerned about is there are triggers. There are triggers, and there are some things you do that triggers people, no matter, even both male or female. Even the ones that both have the so-called anointing. Even that those that have on their hands. So what, what I do know this, is that anything could lead to anybody being raped. We see people who even wear hijab and they get raped. True. Yeah, so baby, can't but can't we have, true. we will not think to even attract a man get but raped. But we will not know that, so that is not an excuse. There are some if this case gets to court, justification. If this case gets to court, and you, they, there are evidences that this is the way you're dressed. You think and the man will be justified? Hell it no. will not be justified. Not in the court of punished. law. Exactly. But you see the full length of the law that you are looking for, you will not get it. Because you're going to be negated on yeah. some facts. Yeah. See, see Cassie, Cassie, you were talking about the fact that she has a right. She could dress anyhow she wants. No, she doesn't. Is it? See, let me tell you something. There are some things that you do that, yes, you're in the full right. But when you come into society like that, you make the, you make it the business of everybody. everybody, not one person, not just yourself. There are some things they call matters of the state. Mm -hmm. You have your freedom until there is a matter of the state, and that mm -hmm. takes precedence, or even over your, your human own, rights. Yeah, mm -hmm. that is one of the matters of the state of our society. Now let's you don't put, do that. Let's even put this fact in. Yeah. Let's even put this fact in. Let's very, not very forget. Quickly, for me, just say for me, I feel this is business. This is their you know, business. You heard what this lady this said. is how they get she said money. She said, mm. you don't, you won't stop me to go where they go. This is how they that get money. Mm. So let's not even forget. That's one major thing again. This is how they get money. This is how they make their money. And this is how they pay the their bills. Still it. At the end of Do the day. Do you understand? We, nobody, see, at Nigeria did day. not stop people from prostituting. At the end of the day. Or from doing other things like this to get money. But there are places where you do that. And All that's right. why it's reserved. For a particular time of day, absolutely. So it's surprising, really, really true. Because mm -hmm. he does. You know why she's uh, angry? Because I, we're, we're raising kids. We're go. raising kids. Wow. We're raising we children. Actually we're raising go. boys, girls. Oh my God! I'm I trying to preserve my home. If my husband were to see this, <laughs> even if he has the most anointing, <laughs> seriously. Okay, we have to go. That's the way. That's the way. We have to preserve the minds of our husbands. Oh my God! It's been such an exciting one on the show today, and at the end of the day, I actually have to say this dress how you want to be addressed okay aside yes. to human rights and everything i'm saying dress how you want to if be you addressed, want to be addressed. And also, as a if you see somebody, somebody who is dressed in a way you don't like please just mind your business too don't harass the person that's another one dress how you want to be addressed this one you don't like how the person is dressed mind your business oh, at oh, the end of the day give you my own words hey you do not talk like that in a society like that if you do 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 that